Hello and welcome back to Nekapara Volume 4. And we're still in France. Boy, it sure has been a minute. This room hasn't changed one bit. She sure said that she had free rooms, so I'm guessing she's letting Kraz use a different room. It really is just how I left it. Now that you mention it, yeah, see my room. My room is somewhat clean. I see cobwebs here and there. I definitely need to find some time to actually get my room together. All that will change when I move out. <laughs> Is that how it works? She has been taking such good care of this room. She's such an unworthy apprentice. Tomorrow's another early day. Let's shower up and get to bed. Oh, sir, though. Of course not. Hurry and take yours first. Are any slouches as they are either. 
ちであの働きっぷりは素晴らしいですね Looks like I don't hold a candle to Shisho when it comes to raising cat girls either. Preferences and cakes all differ from girl to girl. Okay, cinnamon's the odd cat out. She needs the D very badly. Oh no, just thinking to myself. Everyone's personalities are different, but she shows cakes bring smiles to everyone's faces. That's why she has so many variety of cakes. Then what if she makes a cake for one person? Excitement in my eyes. Like, I don't really show that often. And even when I'm doing videos, I really don't show that that very often. In the 10 years I've been doing this, I have been doing Let's Plays on YouTube. Yeah, I haven't shown that in like a long ass time. <clears throat>
They're bell holding cat girls, so they should be the ones pet sitting others. No, I believe in them. I need to do what I set out to accomplish. Besides, there's more in Japan right now. The girls should be sleeping. Serve as them for the time being. Say this now because I think you've got the wrong idea. I don't really sleep together with any of the girls. Chocolate and Vanilla sleep in their own room, and the other go home after work every day, right? Well, yeah, but. Okay, so they had a bit of my dick, okay? But... Like the type of girl share a bed with any of them? Excuse me. No, I mean, it's not like it's off limits, but we all just want to sleep in peace when night rolls around, right? I had an actual bed of my own. One in which I'm not fighting with the. <laughs> the bed spread. <laughs> sure, we will not be having this problem. <laughs> You would be a handful if you were a cat girl. Oh no. You're you, Shigure. My precious little sister. me that you'll be rational and keep some self-control, I'm chucking you out of bed right now. Alright, like I said before, we're getting up early tomorrow, so let's get some shy. train to the airport. From there, I had a long flight. After a short nap on the plane, I landed in France, met Shigure, and grabbed breakfast with her. Then I worked in the original La Salle for the first time in ages. Capping things off, the final item for dinner ended up being my exact ideal flavor. It was one of my mentor's cakes. I feel like I got a grasp on something by speaking with her. After all this time stagnating, I am progressing ever so slightly. I can feel it. At the very least, I feel like a few of the chains that have been constricting my heart are starting to drop. My exhaustion and relief caused me to slip into a deep slumber, like the past couple of days. Oh, 
Did you just put some eyeshadow on more? You want some more? In a moment, my eyes just watered up. <laughs> oh. 
Oh god, I can't. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I slept great, man. I can't remember the last time I conked out like that. Feels like a fog's in my mind. Lift it completely. Shaking her head, did you manage to sleep? Well, huh? Wait, what happened? <laughs> what happened, Shaking her Did you catch a cold? I don't think I did anything to you, but did you didn't do anything, did you? Boy, some shit done happen here. In any case, why don't you hop in the shower? You're dripping with sweat and the sheets are soaking wet. rises up, fixes her disheveled pajamas, and staggers her way to the shower room. What in the hell happened? Do you really want to know? Yes, my head's much clearer now. She felt some things, and she felt some things. here, but as she shall say so, there must be some meaning behind it. Alright then, okay phrase, let's start by swiping the outside. Hi. The two of us work in silence, cleaning up the outside of the shop and setting up the sandwich board. Then again, if it were any lighter, the wind would knock it down. Have you always worked solo, Fraze? I've been in this line and work for much longer, but you're way more diligent than I'll ever be. Really?
Yeah, but that's still no reason to space out in the middle of work. I'm not sure what to say. I, so I feel somewhere between apologetic and pathetic. Of course, I'm more grateful than anything, but that goes without saying. Same here. Suddenly I remember something. Hey, what's the matter? You're in luck. This is where the pastier who can make the world's tastiest cake works. <laughs> well, you do. I love cake myself. That's why I'm training here. <laughs> yeah, I'm having her teach me how to make cakes. Though I'm still not good enough to make anything to brag about. Have some if you like. I tried to make some macaron a la fraise for you. That's right. Fraise is French for strawberry. Like Ichigo is Japanese for strawberry. try helping around the shop. If you do, you'll be able to deliver the tastiness to everyone else. <laughs> Appreciate it. I'm not going to be here for much longer after all. <laughs> oh no, just a trip down memory lane. Actually, I live together with you, Frace, albeit for just a little short while. You were a super small kitten back then, and it was a really short time, so I don't think you remember. You've been smart ever since you were a kid. that you do remember. Nice to meet you again, Face. Hi, Start wiping down the windows. I can feel her staring at me intermittently. We have a little break between the lunch and dinner time periods. Late lunch break. I volunteer to prepare for. I volunteer to prepare the food. I really need to go back and cook. 
食べられて嬉しかったわ、私を。I don't inquire for details, but I assume that Mentor has stayed in Japan in the past. She held the chopsticks perfectly and even knew how to hold her soup bowl. Here's dessert. Since you wanted Japanese food, I made this one bit thing. I would love to make some milk tea once again. Chocolate's calling me too. As I strike you as odd, I also made these if you like. <laughs> yes, I had a little trip down memory lane, so I figured I would try and make you them again. <laughs> Strawberry macaroons. What's the matter, phrase? I found all four of my glasses the, during this short time I've been setting everything up I've actually found all my glasses I've ever worn Sirs, a cat girl picks their name when they're three months old. So that's why. So that's when she came here. you helping out Shisho in such big ways as well. Sorry. 
By the time you came, it was already scheduled to go back home. I'm just as surprised. You got so big that I almost didn't recognize you. Isn't that right, Shisho? Even more customers than we did yesterday. It's looking a lot like Christmas over here. Don't talk like you didn't start it. Shigure holds out her cell phone to reveal a line of comments praising phrase. There are even some customers stating they're explicitly coming to see her, most likely standing in that line outside the shop. Chat for later. Let's get working so we don't keep these customers waiting. And so they do. They do. Guess we'll have to close up shop for today then. Until the stalkers arrive, then you will come to hate them.
Thank you for the fine service, Shisho. I'll take care of cleaning up. Alright, I'll clean up the kitchen. I'll leave the counter and storefront to you guys. As they clean, Faze addresses Shigure. have dinner a little earlier than usual. In a follow-up to last night, she shall treat us to our own cooking. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you very much. Just like last night, we have a spectacular dinner. After Mill, cups of coffee line a table. I think the PR played a part, but I think that the reason why so many people showed up was because your cakes have a stellar reputation. Personally, I'm glad that a lot of people know about your incredible case, Shisho. We both have plans to depart tonight. That's a seven hour time difference between France and Japan. So we need to leave by then in order to make it back home when I promised. In the end, I still don't know what it is I'm missing. I feel a lot better mentally though. No, oh, my apologies. No, that's not true. Well, I'm just still lost on what my father meant by whore. But after coming here and helping in the shop, I remembered something. I really do want to make cakes that bring smiles to everyone's faces. Shisho, your cakes are so good and have such a gentle flavor. <clears throat> Excuse me. That they bring smiles to people's faces. It's sort of like I've been thinking of so much. I've lost sight of my initial focus. I may have said that was my goal, but I was trapped by something else. Surprisingly, that simple answer might have been what my dad was driving at. Thank you very much. Speaking of which, I've talked about my reasons for cake making plenty of times, but Never talked about yours, have you, Shisho? Well, when I asked you in the past, I remember you answered, I make cakes because I'm a pastier, but... In that case, what about your reasons for being a pastier in the first place? Runs in the family. Tradition. Hmm. Huh. I did say that my family owned a Japanese pastry shop, but did I ever mention that they had a history? I became her apprentice to learn West End pastry making, so I avoided mentioning my parents owning a long-standing Japanese pastry shop to make things simpler. Hmm? Hmm? 
No, it's all good. I wasn't trying to keep it a secret. So that's how you know. Oh, I'm sorry for cutting you off. You were saying something about the tri uh, You were saying something about the tradition of La Soleil. Was your reason for making pastries to uphold the flavor from your grandmother's generation? Judging from Fraze's behavior, she seems to know the reasons behind she shall saying that. I recall hearing that you had a son, but I never... She looks like Fujiko from Lupin the Third. story doesn't seem to be leading toward a happy ever は年老いた両親を放っておけなかっただから
I can relate. I really can relate to that. <clears throat> it's like this house I've been in for all my life. I said I've seen a lot and been through a lot with this house. I have been through a lot with this house. I've lived with my parents and my cousin, who was more like a sister to me than anything else. He was she was very much more akin to a big sister than a cousin. My parents passed away in this very house I live in now. I could say that after all this It was my mother who basically shielded me from anything that would hurt me. It wasn't the old man. And it wasn't my dad because he passed away when I was 13. Mom passed away in 2017. It's lasting for about three years now. For a time being, it's just me living in this house. And I'm on a waiting period to see what is going to happen next. <sighs> so don't say I don't understand how that could happen, you know, it, we had a situation like that. So, I get to tell you. It was hard. Family just snowballing itself out of existence. Very much like our situation. Except that the house kept changing hands. From my mom's name, or rather the family name, to the old man's family name. And now we're going to be switching it back to my family name. So that's what you meant by inheriting the flavor but losing the title. I can't believe that's what happened.
私の作っているお菓子は幼い息子が美味しいと褒めてくれた味なのねする息子の気持ちを彼は言いにくい
That's understandable. My mom was about the same. She worked most of her life. And she tried. So did I was she was an eye no, you wouldn't. There have been times I had rough days, and I might have just snapped just because work was hard, or I had one of them days that just basically snowballed like nobody's business. Or maybe I was just tired and I just needed downtime before I actually wanted to interact with the rest of my family. But in retrospect, I never saw my mom as a nuisance. I can't begin to imagine how her son must feel considering I've never even met him. But what if it were me? What I want to reunite with my mother if she left me behind and went overseas while I was still a kid? You bet your ass I would! Or would I say it's too late and refuse entertaining the idea? Considering his feelings. to a mother and, and her child? No. It never does. <laughs> well, I couldn't consider what you did at the time as a mistake. I mean, if you had remained in Japan, 
and hadn't resumed business as a pastier here. I wouldn't have ever encountered such wonderfulness in pastries. I don't think what you did in the past was a mistake, but I do think it's a fact that you couldn't take your son's feelings into consideration at the time. Still, if your son is an adult now, I'm pretty sure that he's considering how you must have felt too. <laughs> Perhaps, but nothing is certain, which is why I think you should give your son a visit. I apologize for speaking outside my boundaries. Forgive me, Shisho. I didn't mean to make you tell such a sad tale. Me? On the right path? Well, I certainly like to think so. Shisho regrets the fact that she was separated from her family. I left my house voluntarily and became estranged from my parents. Ever since that verbal spat I had on my mom's birthday, I haven't gotten in contact with them even once. I'd say it definitely feels as though I'm on the wrong path, but... Right now, do you mean I didn't have this something in the past? Then I start to think about the girls. Yes, of course. I should be the one thanking you for the hospitality praise. If they ever make a volume five, I mean, yes. Sure, well, next time I come, I won't be coming for counseling. I'll be able to make even tastier cakes by then, I'll, and then I'll come back to let you try them. Shisho, I really appreciate everything. <laughs> Tell 
do I? I can't really tell, but perhaps you're right. I do feel somewhat more refreshed now. I felt weirdly pressured before, but now I think I've got more of an idea of what I want to do. Or maybe I should say that what I need to do is clear now. but I guess you could say I found what the words putting smiles on people's faces really means. Yeah, I think it is. Uh, yeah, I think so at least. truth, I feel that Nekopara is one of those games that make me open up about myself. In which, in which there's, there hasn't been a way to do it as naturally as this. Not being pressured to do this or even feel like it's an assignment, but it's more like I'm opening myself myself up more through this more than any other video I've ever done. Or, or rather more more of a video series I've ever done. In a sense, I'm actually glad I I'm doing this. I'm actually glad I started doing this series. I'm really glad that Sekai Project is continuing this series. How long it's gonna last, but I hope it lasts for a few more episodes. That's where we are. That is not how we actually came over here, but that is how we're going to go back home. Trace takes the envelope and checks the contents. Inside the envelope is a travel voucher. have the time to get a travel voucher, Shigure? How did she do that if she was with me ever since I stepped foot in France? She's a woman of action, as always. It's about time. Shisho, please take care. I'll be back again. No guarantees, but I promise. Right, duly noted. <laughs> That's me every time I'm I'm doing videos for like hours and hours on end. Like, have you actually slept? What? <laughs> slept? You know? Oh, sleep. Um, 
No, but I'll make sure. Do we know it? She sure was. I can't imagine my mentor closing the shop for an extended period of time. But yeah, it'd be nice if they could come for even a few days. Yeah, praise a great cat girl. The two of us walk and chat about cat girls. <sighs> sure got cold. I should be the one telling you that. By the way, a little late to be asking now, but I assume you have a return ticket. I wouldn't think Shigure of all people would make an oversight like that. But I ask regardless. How did you search my flight itinerary? And I'm doing two Let's Plays around this time period. Long before Christmas is even a thing. Then again, I'm close to finishing a few, so... I'm just knocking this out now because that way it's one less thing I have to worry about when I upload. Somewhat. Shigure pulls her rather big carry-on case. Looks pretty heavy. This was a two-night trip by plane, which means it was roughly a one-night stay. You're packing quite a load for such a short time. But of course. Yeah. I wouldn't put too much faith in getting your luggage delivered to the airport in France. Coming from personal experience, you're pretty much leaving it to chance. That is true. It's a short walk to the bus stop, or rather, it's not too far to justify taking a cab. Shigure, I can take that for you if it's too much. Just ask before you break your back. Huh? Looking out for my little sister, carrying a bunch of heavy luggage isn't something new for me, is it? I don't think that I've ever been that heartless before. Actually, I just might dote a little too much. Oh, would I? 
嬉しいことですし私は感謝したと思いますがでも今の兄様は私に判断を任せてくれました I just said what I said because it felt natural. Uh, sure. Not sure how I feel about my sister being able to pick up on something about me better than well, me. I don't really think I've changed any, but maybe I did if you say so. The days I spent with the girls, she shows words, all those things have probably helped shape the person I am now. Well, she sure was willing to share that much of her story with me. I could learn a thing or two myself. Yeah, I think. I tried thinking of my own reasons for pastry making. Yeah, I'm starting to think those were just words. No, I mean the real reason deep in my heart I tried giving my own feelings some deep thought. Ultimately, I just wanted Dad to approve of me. A little too old to be going through my rebellious teenager phase, I know. I'm pretty sure I'm being egotistical and trying to seek approval. Sorry, Shikidai, did I shatter your illusion of me? That is something I'm going to share personally. That, that's going in my personal right there. If it wasn't, I wouldn't be this broken up about Dad disapproving of me. Well, that's true, but I definitely felt frustrated having him boss me around. I couldn't find it in me to comply, so I went to study abroad in France. No, that was just... Um, yeah. At one part, when I first started doing videos on YouTube, doubt was the mindset I had originally. To please people. Doubt's what it all came down to originally. Me doing videos. Let's Plays in particular, that was all for getting approval, to be liked. And then all of a sudden I just slipped right into just the fact of doing them just to be doing them, just because I love playing video games. I love reliving a part of my life in which 
I never had so much stress on me. I was a lot younger. I had a better life. I had a, bit, a better structure on myself. And that's even before YouTube was a thing. Seriously. Like, growing up, I didn't want to do anything but, you know, just go to school. You know, have, um, you know, maintain good grades. You know, I just wanted to keep, I just wanted to do what's right. What I'm being asked to do. And then when it comes down to it, <clears throat> up until I, I turned into, turned into say, 20, 22, 23, it was one before um, I went to Japan, but it was, it was in my 20s, my early 20s, I sat in my, I s sat in church and I started thinking, what the hell am I doing all this shit for? Why am I even at church? I shouldn't even... I, I should be asleep. I should be watching TV. I should be doing a lot of things. But church is not this thing I should be doing. I should be... at home. There's a lot of things that were going on in my head. And then when I came on YouTube in 2010, because I've always been on YouTube, but i never done anything as far as video is concerned since 2010. So I've been a watcher since 2006, but as far as me doing something, that was like four years after 2010. Like I said, I've been around for a whole decade. A whole decade of me doing Let's Plays and whatnot. And not because, oh hey, it's popular. I'm I'm not doing anything for popularity. You like it, that's good. That's awesome. That's the reason why I just do what I do. I just forget about subs and all that. I've just grown out of it. That's what it is. But in the back of my head... Even games like these, or stories, or novels like these, it makes me open up. Even when I first started the series, first it started with Sheena. She said, well, you know, she liked it because it was different. Then I kind of grew out of the... It's not until I met the people who, who were behind Nekapara that I just said, you know what? Thank you. I'm probably one of their fans that just say, thank you for actually making the series. You've made me into a fan of this series. And even now, as I say this, if, if any of them watch it, if it even reaches out to them, in some way, or even I will write a letter to where the headquarters is, I let them know. It has changed my life.
you're right. I'm allowed to feel more than one way. I do have a desire for Dad's approval, but at the same time, I can't deny that I want to make sweets that put smiles on people's faces. I have a feeling that trying to ignore that unseemly desire was throwing me off balance. Thanks, you guys. I feel like I can move forward a little bit knowing that. And that's chapter five. And you know what? I'm actually gonna stop here. Because oh my god, that was real emotional. Indeed. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop here in the next part. After a cup of coffee and probably probably a, a some cereal. I will continue chapter 5 and most likely head on to the final chapter. So stay tuned more of Nekopara. Volume 4 right after this. Thanks so much for watching.